Yo guys, good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. Hope you guys are having an awesome day. My name is Jaster. Welcome to the channel. Welcome back to the channel. Today, I'm going to be doing another update to a video that I just did regarding the Poke mod for the TCG card shop simulator. Been getting a lot of comments on that one, and it did already just get updated. So yeah, was getting some confusion. So I'm going to try to make this as more understandable as possible. If you guys like this video, make sure you guys hit the like button, subscribe to the channel because our new videos go a long way and support a small creator like me get my videos more out there so without further ado let's hop right in let's not waste any more time so of course i am on the pokemon official page i'll have that link down below of course to make your job a little bit more easier now of course like i said in the previous video you guys actually do want to have an account to be able to download files from here so make sure you guys sign up email password easy peasy now you're gonna need a couple files here of course first thing we're gonna go here and go to the description pokemon 3.2 has been released the video that i just did was with the pokemon 3.1 but the cool thing about this one is that it's actually future proofing for downloads or updates so right here you guys can see from now on game updates won't break pokemon and prevent you from playing the worst that could happen is that the custom music and some other stuff might be missing after a game update but everything else will work fine as long as the mod is installed correctly i'll update those assets in the next patch when needed and i do want to apologize guys if i do sound a little tired it is currently three in the morning as i'm trying to film this update video for you guys so make sure you guys hit that like button <clears throat> all right so with that out of the way of course you still need to download the bepin ex and texture replacer which will go ahead and open up with different uh pages here this is for the bepin so of course same thing you'll go over to files and you'll hit manual download and i'll show you guys how that looks you guys can see of course slow download if you guys have the free version you'll hit that and then you'll get this couple seconds before it starts downloading then it'll start downloading so it'll show right here boom started downloading so i already have it downloaded so we're good to go so the next thing of course will be the same thing with the texture replacer 1.0.0 so manual download and you'll get that downloaded as well and you're good to go you have everything downloaded and right here we have the files on our desktop right here i did go ahead and actually save my original files in a separate folder so you guys can actually open up steam go to tcg card shop simulator manage browse local files you can go over here to card shop simulator data and this is everything that i actually copied so if you guys ever just want to go back to the original game you guys can do so so just copy those files just to be safe and go ahead and go back there and have those in that folder so actually before we continue i want you guys to actually go to the tcg g card shop simulator hit manage because most of you probably already have been trying this so you guys want to make sure you guys go to properties and go to um install the files and right here you want to go ahead and actually hit that and verify your integrity of files so it can just get all the files that have been compromised or anything like that so see all 195 files successfully validated but that's just for the people that have already been trying and mess with your files just so you can get all the files that you may have deleted or have gotten lost damaged or whatever the case is just go ahead you guys do that before you guys get started with all this process so i already did it we're good to go go ahead out and the first thing we want to do is of course get this weapon x pack inside here so we'll go ahead and copy this right here boom we're going to copy the weapon x this one right here so we're copying that folder let's minimize that we'll go back to steam manage browse local files and then right here we're gonna download that right there boom it's inside already there it is nice so next thing you want to go ahead and do we'll go ahead and close that up now for the next one it's going to be the texture replacers so right here we'll go ahead and copy this folder bam copied minimize that go back to steam same thing manage browse local files we'll have it over to the bepin we'll go to plugins right here and right here you want to go ahead and paste that texture replacer right there boom that's in you are good to go we can back out of that we'll minimize that again real quick and now for the final step which is the new 3.2 version right here you guys want to open that we'll copy this folder right here bam that's copied minimize that go back to steam same thing manage browse local files 
and then you'll hit over here common you have steam steam apps and then common hit common and right here you'll just paste it you'll be prompted like this if you have any files to replace just hit replace boom it's all in there we can close that let's boot up the game all right guys here we are we're back at the menu same thing as before we are good to go version 0.46 all the files are in we can load game boom i did just do a video showing you guys some gameplay with the pokemon if you guys are interested i have that link down below as well go check that out and here we are guys we are in let's go to settings our music is kind of low here so i think the music is actually there we go Had my headphones off so yeah there it is the music was on all along and there it is music is going we can go in here lower that a little bit and boom there it is guys i hope this one was a little bit more easier to follow sorry about the last video but yeah they just updated it and from here on out it should be easier to update the game shouldn't break after the game receives a new update so that's a really cool feature and yeah just keep an eye out for future videos or on the page of the developer so when new updates come out you guys are notified and know all that good stuff but yeah guys hope you guys enjoyed make sure you guys hit that like button subscribe to the channel if you guys are new and i'll catch you guys on the next one take care peace